A family improves the fate of the people, said the Prime Minister. Political situation of the country has not yet taken into an alarming turn, said E.C. Rafiqul Islam. And BNP's threats cannot vest the election, said Hanif. Upcoming elections is becoming a hoax, said Fakul. Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to my TV news. I'm Fozera Shunakhtar with you in the newsroom today. We are still watching the headlines. Now the details. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina has said that a warm league improves the fate of the people and the BNP burns the people. He said the Awami League took strict measures against the militants. Sheikh Hasina also said that the new city will be built in the near future if she goes to power. Top leaders of the ruling Awamalik-led alliance are also attended the rally held at Gulshan Youth Club ground this evening. Election Commissioner Rafiqul Islam said the ongoing violence among political parties ahead of the December 30 national election is nothing but a part of the political culture. Stray incidents of a violence are taking place ahead of the election, but the situation has not yet taken into an alarming tone. It is a part of Pool's culture indeed, he said. Rafiq al-Islam came up with the observation while talking to reporters before attending a workshop in Rajshahi city this morning. The election commission in association with the United Nations of Women, UNDP and the Swiss Agency for Development and Cooperation organized the workshop. Awam League Joint General Secretary Mahbubul Alam Hanif said BNP has now threatened various government officials to scare the election process. But the government is determined to counter any kind of terrorism. Such threats cannot vest the election, he told reporters during his election campaign and a public meeting at Kushtia Shadri Pozila's Horipur Union. BNP General Secretary Mirza Fakhrul Islam Alamgir has said that due to abstraction of a BNP candidates, the upcoming parliamentary election is becoming a hoax. At a press conference held at Chair Pence's political office in Gulshan, he said, BNP is not getting justice even from the High Court. On the other hand, a standing committee member, Nazrul Islam Khan, said that the election commission has to bear the responsibility of the candidates who have been postponed and rejected from the High Court recently. The body of renowned film director Amzad Hussain will reach in Dhaka this evening. A flight of Bangladesh Airlines carrying the body took off at 4.15 p.m. today from Thailand, which is scheduled to arrive at HSIA around 7 p.m. The celebrated film director breathed his last at Boomerang Grand International Hospital in Bangkok on December 14. Earlier, Amzad Hussain suffered a stroke at his residence on November 18. Later, he was taken to the intensive care unit of Impulse Hospital in the capital. On November 27, he was sent to Bangkok by an air ambulance for better treatment after Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina took the responsibility for his treatment. That's all from our newsroom for now. Thanks for being with us. To join with My TV News online, visit www.youtube.com slash News. And to watch all your programs on YouTube, visit youtube.com slash Bangla. Our next bulletin will be telecast in Bangla at 7.30pm. Don't forget to join with us. Till then, stay connected. Allah Hafiz.